Give this video 10,000 likes or this creature will come out from under your bed. Sauron, the lieutenant of the tower. No, oh, the black hand. The, what was it? No, no, the mouth of Sauron. Yeah, we saw that guy also in, uh, you. in the movies. Well, in the extended edition, that is. Like, for some reason, now that they have it, it's, it feels incomplete, incomplete to watch the Lord of the Rings movies and not watch the extended What's version. It's, it's called it's a lot more. Business. Hmm. Stay right here. Don't move. Don't touch anything. Barrat. The pincers! Wait until you hear the gong, then go upstairs and do what you're told. Barrat. Yes! We don't want to wait for gongs, do we? We're right here, in the tower, so close to the bridge. Hide in the cart and off we goes. But we can't do that yet, can we? Not without a friendly driver. And we see no friendly faces here. <laughs> what does it want from us, this sorcerer? Ask riddle questions, perhaps. Rip our hearts out with his claws. But we know riddles too, don't we, my precious? <laughs> Closed. Maybe there's another way in. <sighs> what does it want from us, this sorcerer? <laughs> yeah, so that's the only way in. I can't believe he actually has a window. I mean, then again, it's probably a ventilation system. We go. Holy shit, I almost fell from my deck. Well, it kind of, uh, it kind of is understandable. I mean, um, a big tower, it's technically a skyscraper, it needs a lot of oxygen to get up there, so they will need some sort of ventilation system. And also a good place for Gollum to sneak around in. Yes, the whispers. Such a horrific accident in the mines. Naturally, there's talk. And how fast can talk turn to disorder? <coughs> Thy daughter has a lovely profile. It reminds me of a sponge. A sponge. What the hell? Has the Carnictus from the King Kong made its way here? Resistance. Quite unlike her mother. Yeah, this guy is considering he's a sorcerer. He's uh, into like all this voodoo stuff. I want to frighten thee. I only ever wished there to be friendship between us. You are not my friend. In that case, you should be frightened. Ah! Uh, that's what they hurt our hands is with. Read. I don't care for your lofty tone. What is this? Your handwriting. Speaking of lofty tones, I found this quite illuminating. Who gave you this? Read it. I know what it says. I never forget my own words. Does our lord? <laughs> Art thou trying to threaten me? I only ever wish there to be friendship between us. Hmm. Consider the matter dealt with. Which matter? The bridge in the mines. And don't ever talk about my family again. Have a good night, Lieutenant. It'll okay, I need to step back to make it look like I'm not eavesdropping. I must visit you more often. Down here in the pits. Map of Middle Earth.
The slave must salute the lieutenant of Lugbours. Oh, he bows to the great master. Yes, yes. Hmm. What are you doing in here? He's expecting you. Come closer. Are you dying of some illness? Come closer. <laughs> well, given that I'm stuck under there, it would be there is a lot of potential for a ton of illnesses to spread. You must have many questions. <laughs> Our Lord hates questions. Questions. Three ways to silence them. Fear, one way. Two, a negative. Please, it wasn't us. Why is your number on the list? You're not strong. You're not wise. Clearly, you're not wise. See, that raises questions. Was the great eye mistaken? Certainly not. So why? You weren't the only one behind that act of sabotage. And it certainly wasn't that orc who had to die for it. What's a third way to silence a question? Hmm? Well, giving an answer. Fear. Knife. Answer. Which one do you think we should apply? Answer. Good. So, what is the answer? It wasn't us. Because you were on the list. I know that. You know that. What about everyone else? Yes. Good men were buried underneath that bridge. And thus, a head must roll. And if it cannot be yours, then whose head shall it be? He wants us to give him names. Or it's a test. Huh. Well... I'm trying to be an honest person, so... A trick to send Smeagol into the light. Tell him the truth. Masters won't send us to the tower again. Smeagol is on the list. Perhaps, yes. But he can hurt our hands. We saw his pincers, didn't we? Knives, scissors, so many ways to make poor Smeagol hurt. Don't let him, precious. Don't let him hurt our hands. No, not our hands, my love. Not if we speaks the truth. So? The frail man. It forced us. It was him. Hmm. The old desert king? Him and his friends. But we don't know their names. Don't worry. We will find them. Take that as your first lesson. Never leave any witnesses. Candleman wants us. Don't call me that. <laughs> you can go now. All right then, so uh, something tells me we're going to be his pet now. Ugh, weeks later, seriously. Waiting for my father, aren't we all? What does he see in you? I really cannot fathom. Staunchness. That's a word I haven't heard in a while. <sighs> Say your prayer, little man. The Great Eye sees us. Go on. The Great Eye knows us. Good lad. Gollum, breathing holes, now. Go, you don't want to make him wait. Hmm. 
Yeah, these black Numenorians uh, are just not likable people. This way. Don't want to make him wait. She speaks from experience. <laughs> these days, Candleman's mood swings like a pendulum. Yes, and why we wonders? He needs that daughter of his. She has too many ideas. <sighs> so I wonder what we have to do now. Oh, not that guy again. Crucial bridge, either. A little setback, granted, but let's not fool ourselves. It was only a bridge. Thinking about it, maybe you deserve a second chance. Thank you, my lord. Excuse me for a second. Mm. Come with me. Okay. And why do they always dress? You it's know... time for you to learn how to breed our carrier birds. This is the oven. As far as I understand, it's all about finding the right temperature. Get used to the equipment. In the morning, I want to see results. But Smeagol doesn't know. He doesn't know how. Start with the oven. Each egg needs a different temperature. Which egg you choose, that's up to you. Or... Where is it, the old breeder? Gone. Don't forget to bring my keys when you're done. Yeah, the old breeder liked to scratch. Hated that noise. Mm. Had to take his knife away. Hmm. So there's more of these, eh? Where does the sun go up? Mm. Uh, where? These are the keys where to the bird. The sun go yes. up. In the oh, no, no. no, that's not how it goes. <laughs> how does one make the a bird? I'm sorry. They will put our heads up on spikes for all to I see. We won't let them, my dear. We will... What's this for? What do you think? It's a pot. You fill it with Mormac, then you throw the egg in. What's this? The Mormac. It makes the birds smart and strong. White, brown, black. Hmm. Each of them creates a different kind of bird. Well... So, wait, hold on. And that's for the brown one. Ah, so that's the white one. Well, I'll definitely then uh, have that one, as white is one of my favorite colors. <laughs> Alright, I'm glad to see that moving up. Well, what are these two idiots just standing there for? Make a fire. How many logs do we need? Don't ask me. Mm -hmm. I, I don't think it's a good idea to ever ask orcs, considering they're so dumb they don't know anything. They adorable. That's one one of the stuff this game did good. So in case the save file for the scene got corrupted, but Gollum is calling this thing Little One, and uh, you'll be very valuable.